Okay, so I feel I want to do myself a bit more justice with cold waters after yesterday's video. Yesterday's video was literally me never having even started the game. It had been released about five minutes before I actually booted it up. So we're gonna go for the campaign, we're gonna go for North Atlantic 1984 and see if we can make a better... Yeah, we got the USS Baron Roar, SSN 689, Los Angeles class. And so we got Reagan, who are not liked by the Soviets, and the Soviets doesn't like Reagan, and the Soviets who doesn't really like being provoked, and the Soviets shooting down a passenger jet, and some Pershing missiles in Europe, and a screenshot from Strike Fighters to Europe. And then we have the Reds declaring war. So our orders are to intercept enemy cruise missiles, submarine is transiting towards the New Windows Sea, towards the North Atlantic convoy routes. We must sink it. Enemy sub believed to be diesel electric. Juliet class may have diesel sub, sub attack escort. Alright, so that's our main objective here. And we gotta cast away and we gotta go for it. We'll be creeping up alongside the Norwegian Sea, so we might actually encounter friendly units as well. Contact! Contact! Bearing 9-2, designate Sierra 1. Storm, high wind, no surface duct, very work female layer. All hands manual battle stations. Start creeping, one third. Find the boss and some, put some torpedoes into them. Nice and slow. That's the key. Gonna just speed up the gameplay for you. Sierra 1 is capacitating. We got contacts. Very close, very close. Weapon away, weapon away. Bl we're go going for a blind fire here, but hopefully it will be sufficient for our purposes. Damn, torpedo j just broke its wire. That's not good. But we know where they are now. We'll be creeping in that direction. Ahead, one third. Go. I'm glad the comp Oh fuck, they're close. Hold it, do not fire.
Active sonar, aye. Tango, tango, tango. Go. Detach cable, let her go. You shall not pass! Tango down. Find that Juliet and take it down. I said it before, I say it again. The soundtrack and- OH FUCK 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 FUCK! We got a May right above us. This is not good. Crash dive! Crash dive! There's not even a layer for us to hide below. Let's just hope it's enough. Let's go 300 and hope that's enough to hide from the May. We are at 234 feet, speed 5 knots. I think we got away from the May. Not sure, but we need to find that Juliet.
I think this is where the May dropped either a torpedo or a listening buoy. Yeah, I need some reminder regarding the controls, so... Looks like I can actually maneuver my torpedoes in flight. That might actually be very useful. Not what I'm looking for, however. I seem to have forgotten how to program the signatures. So I might actually have to return to the tutorials at some point to learn more so I can actually master this game. I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys like seeing my failures because that means you can write snide comments about them, but I would actually prefer to do better than that, really. We're gonna speed it up a bit, see if we can find the Juliet. Yeah, I still need to find where the hell you... This is just where you... It could be I, or whatever. We're not looking for Contact Tango, we're looking for Contact Juliet. Lever her off. I'm fairly certain the contacts we have here are the May and not actually a submarine, but I can't be sure. Right now, the majority of the sounds we're hearing should be from the Tango wreck. And I don't know if we can actually hide behind them, but... Active sonar, aye. I'm fairly certain these three are from the May, but I'm not convinced. We're gonna turn a bit in that direction, but not entirely. See, this is what the game is really all about. Patience, nerve-wracking, waiting to see if you can find the target. And maybe, just maybe, we might have a big problem with the Juliet actually finding us. Switching to active passive zone up. Aye. We're gonna keep speeding it up, see what we can find. However, if I was to Juliet, I would basically just stay still and hope for the best. Yeah, sorry, this is basically my second running of this game, so I need to have a reminder of the controls again. It's not really what I like to do, but here's... Yeah.
better have a reminder than anything else, so. What I'm looking for doesn't even seem to be here. Yeah, we're just gonna have to do this the slow and painful way then. And then I have to redo the entire detection tutorial all over again. I'm gonna investigate this contact here. I think it's a uh, May or another uh, anti submarine aircraft, but I need to check it out. We are, however, gonna check it out nice and slow. We're not gonna rush into things. Uh, no vessels nearby. I think Juliet just just actually escaped us. Yeah, the Juliet is undetected, so we'll just keep on moving. Uh, recent mission has been evaluated as a failure to meet mission goals. Means lost tonnage for the convoys and the enemy wanting to step closer to close to the Atlantic. Yeah, we need to be better than this, yeah. Find and destroy tenders and tankers. This should be easy. Surface ships are much e- Oh, fuck. Fuck! Let's hope that is our target and not actually the anti-submarine guys finding us. So let's load torpedoes, three torpedoes and a harpoon. And then settle with that. We'll go nice and slow, see if we can find some targets. Slow to a crawl. We don't want to be detected unless we can avoid it. Got a contact behind us. Sierra 1. She's cavitating. We're gonna slow down, turn around and sink her. Take it slow. Weapon away. We got Sierra 2 very close, very close. So, here's where I basically stop everything and see, once again, the controls on how to just cut the wire so we can engage the thing. Yeah, shift alpha 4. I cut the wire, but I don't know what happened to our torpedo. Might have to fire another one at CR2. Now 
Nah, our previous torpedo is still tracking, hopefully. But it might be a surface contact, and yeah, we got a cash in. Let's hope our torpedo is intelligent enough to sink that cash in, because we don't want that cash in to interfere with us, do we? Right now, following Torpedo 2, if I can, if I think I uh, made it correctly. Yeah, I think I'm following Torpedo 2. And if that's the case, it should break any time now. Crap! It's engagement envelope, it's too narrow. The caching just made it out of it. We'll have to fire again. Reload! Hey, that's a really nice ship. Let's sink it. Let's hope Sierra 1 is still and ready to be engaged by our torpedo number two here. We're gonna speed it up a bit. Hope for the best. Contact faded. That's not good. We got our torpedo maneuvering towards enemy targets. Here we go. Target hit. The cash in has been hit. I don't know if we actually sunk her. She seems damaged, but that's that's about it. Holy crap, we got bears and whatnot, bears and tigers and everything that's dropping torpedoes at us! Fuck! Level are off and designate CR3. Weapon away. Pier Sierra 1 has left the area. We don't have any detection on her. There goes the Cation. Our torpedo is hitting straight for Sierra 3. Let's hope we get a kill. Torpedo 3 has reached the engagement envelope. Torpedo away. 
Mark 40, 48. Hey, you look good on the bottom. Torpedo free is tracking Sierra free. Contact seems to be a surface target. Sierra Free is gonna get out of the engagement envelope. This is not good. We got a Cara. I say again, we got a Cara. That's nice. That seems to be a missile cruiser. That's a good kill. Or wait, that's not a missile cruiser, that's just a ton of anti-submarine ordnance. We just put it to the bottom. There's only one problem. Our order specifically said to avoid contact with enemy anti-surface warship groups. Torpedo away. It seems like number four ha had a... Uh, could have a small detection on Sierra One, but I'm not convinced. We'll see what happens. Sierra One is closer than anticipated. Actually, I don't think even think we have a proper position on Sierra. We sunk Sierra 1. However, that doesn't... I think we got a hit on Sierra 1, but there's no telling what Sierra 1 actually was. Uh, there is a possibility we sunk a friendly sh or neutral ship, but I don't think so. Or rather, I don't... I hope so. Either way... Ooh, we sunk a Victor 2, a Cashin, and a Kara. That's good stuff right there. <laughs> not our mission. No, it was not our mission. We made it, but... Oh, we still got the Bronze Star for sinking three enemy ships. Contact Sierra 1. Let's sink her. Contact Sierra 3 is fading. Slow down. Whatever it is, it seems to have a sonar. We got Sierra 2. Contact.
Slow down, slow down. We're cavitating. See if you can level us off at 50 feet. Up scope. I don't see him in the surface contact, and that's bad news. Master one signature. I have no idea what the hell that means. But they're close. Really close. Periscope down. Take evasive action. Weapon away, weapon away. For all I know, I could be firing at a whale here. Ooh, nice harbor facilities. Seriously, can we talk about how good this soundtrack is? Let's speed it up a bit, see if we can hit M1 with that torpedo. She's moving rather slowly. I think I might actually be torpedoing a whale here. Target is within engagement envelope. I don't think it's M1 that's sending out the sonar signals. They seem a bit off for that. Helicopter. God damn it. I hope the helicopter is not the M1, because if that's the case, I'm in trouble. Yeah, the torpedo just ignored M1, so I don't think M1 is anything we have to worry about. Or it's a helicopter, and then we really need to worry about it. It could be a sonar buoy as well. And if that's the case, well, we're boned. Active sonar, active sonar. Our torpedo is tracking something, but I don't really know what. It might be that M2 disappeared off in that direction, but I'm not convinced.
Our torpedo might still engage S2 as well. M1 was a ship, and she sunk. However, we got bears. Having bears around is not fun at all. All stop, all stop. Slowly, upwards, slowly. We're hit. I say, yeah, we're hit. We better get out of here. We get more contacts. I think the car might have gotten their anti-submarine rockets off before they... Here's hoping we can hit S2 with that thing. Crash dive, crash dive. Passing 200. Level her out. I don't think our cruise missile has found any targets. Yeah, we're hit. This is not good. Not good at all. Well, we got vessels nearby, weapons nearby, aircraft nearby, and everything's flooding. Uh, we need to have at least a flooding control to leave the area. Evasive pattern, Gamma 1. Stand by quantum torpedoes. Head flank. Deploy noisemaker one. Noisemaker two away. to avoid this torpedo. Free! Away! She's going for the countermeasures! Slow down. One third. Aye.
He's got us back again. Evasive pattern Delta 1. Ahead flank. Pull up. We're damaged, but not critically. We might still be in this fight. Level out. One third. Go. Increase the ballast. Go. The bear is back. We need to stay cool. Oh fuck, we're dead. We are very, very dead. Abandon ship. Abandon ship. Abandon ship. The Victor 2 escaped, the cash in was undetected, and the Kara was sunk. Hey, looks like we got a new submarine since we actually survived the sinking of the last one. We got the USS Dallas! Sweet! I am kind of surprised they actually decided to give me a submarine after the last, last uh, assignment, but hey, let's go. I mean, I can't have been the best of captains, really. There really needs to be better captains than me on the list. I don't know if that submarine is my target or not, but I really should make an effort to just... ...sink the shit out of it. All hands, this is the Dallas. We have spotted the Red October. Sonar, do you hear anyone sing the Russian national anthem? Over. Contact. It's an enemy submarine, Foxtrot class. Torpedo away. Should be right on the engagement envelope for the torpedo. Come on, just for once I want a one shot, one kill situation here. Yeah, torpedo is tracking. The Foxtrot has evaded us. The Foxtrot has used the new Russian teleporting system. Torpedo two away. I think we actually got a kill. Yeah, we got a kill with the first one. The second one appears 
it appears that well, data from sensors can be wrong at times, and if that's the case, I love it. Con, wire break, MK48. Well, we got the bastard, so that's that. Head full, take us up. It appears we may have an enemy torpedo in the water. No, we have our own torpedo in the water! Fuck that! This is embarrassing. This is really, really embarrassing! Oh, come on! Haven't these guys heard of an IFF system? We sunk the Foxtrot, but that was not our mission target, and we're damaged from our own fucking torpedo! Can't believe that happened. Let's see if we can find what we're supposed to sink. It's supposed to be near Achelle I can't pronounce that shit. Oh crap. The bear might have found us. Not convinced. Let's see if we can sneak in here and think the... Yeah, we can sneak in here. However, we don't seem to be able to actually find the group that is our target here, so... Let's just move up and see if... What happened now? I think the game's bugged. Yep, and so ends the illustrious career of me with a game bug and... Well... Getting damaged by my own torpedo. In hindsight, I should have returned to port. can't even enter a menu or anything. Yeah, the game's definitely bugged.